Hi Taurus, welcome to my channel. To those of you who are new, welcome, welcome, welcome. This is your general reading for March. Now, after I pull tarot, I will pull an oracle card for you guys. This is a general, so know that it will not resonate with everyone. So please just take what does. Don't worry about the rest. All right, don't forget to subscribe. Hit that notification bell. And let's get started for Taurus. What do we have for Taurus? What do we have for Taurus? We're going to take a look at your energy at this time, Taurus. We'll take a look at what you're attracting at this time. We'll also take a look at what you need to know, and then we'll pull an outcome for you. All right. For Taurus. Here we go. All right, Taurus, we have the Emperor. We have the Seven of Pentacles. We have the Page of Cups. And we have the Empress here. Okay. So your energy right now, Taurus, with the Emperor here, I feel like a lot of you guys are really just wanting to get things started. You guys are really trying to build some type of structure here, some have some type of order with what it is that you're wanting to do. I feel like a lot of you are really trying to create something here, but it's like you're getting, it's like you're bringing the pieces together, really trying to put it together here. Having the power and the gumption and the confidence, Taurus, to move forward with this venture, to move forward with what you're trying to create. Now, you guys also have the seven of pentacles here. So I see this is something that you're taking your time with. It's not something that you're going to rush, even though you might be excited and you want to because you want to get it done, but you're going to take your time. This is something that you're going to make sure that you take every little measure that you need when creating this, when starting this, this is something that is going to um, be worked on slowly here. And a lot of you might start to feel like, oh my God, okay, I'm taking too long. Is it ever going to get done? Will I ever do this? <clears throat> but having that patience and still working on what you need to work on, Taurus, is where you're really going to see the fruits of your efforts. You're really going to see what you have accomplished when it blooms. So don't, don't let that patience or that, you know, that feeling of you're in that place where you have to be patient and it's taking time, uh, make you feel some kind of way. All right. Because it's really crucial and it's really important with what you're trying to build and with what you're trying to take control uh, with and move forward here. Now you have a page of cups here. So this is what you need to know. It's important for you to know that you need to express yourself creatively with what you're trying to do here, what you're trying to build here and what you're putting time into all your work and all your efforts. It's going to pay off. So just know if this is something near and dear to you, you will do it and succeed. The outcome here is the Empress. So definitely you're going to be putting something new out there to, to, to help people. Uh, it's something that people are going to enjoy, but it's going to grow. So there is abundance here for you with this Taurus. So just continue to be patient and take the time that you need and express yourself creatively. Don't be afraid to make it your own. Don't be afraid to take your power, your control, build it, make it and get it done. Do you do you. It's going to take time but it's all going to pay off. Let's get a little more here for you. Okay. So we have the nine of wands. We have the full, there's that something new there. Okay. Let's see what else we got here. Queen of swords. Okay. Bottom of the deck. Bottom of the deck is the king of pentacles, Taurus. So yeah. A lot of you are definitely creating something new, something 
That's like, it's like a new beginning for you. It makes you feel like it's a new beginning. And that's something that you've been attracting. It's like, you've been attracting this new beginning for yourself. Something that you might've not even ever thought that you would get into or enjoy. Right. But you're thinking about it. You're in it and you're excited and you're feeling good and you're going with it. You're taking risk. It's all about taking that leap, that leap into the work, the progress, having patience and doing it right. Now you have the nine of wands here. So your energy, not only are you feeling like you're really coming into your own and this is something that is yours. This is something that you are really trying to make sure you can um, put it out there in the right way, Taurus. But I see that you guys might feel like it's a lot. A lot of you might be feeling like it's a lot for you to be doing yourself, but you can do it. So there are going to be times or there might be times now, Taurus, where you're feeling really tired, you're feeling really stressed, but you're still moving forward and going to do what you want to do with that emperor energy. Because with the emperor here and this being your energy at this time, Taurus, nothing is going to stop you. What you want to do, you're going to do. What you want to go for, you're going to go for. What you want to achieve or conquer, you will achieve and conquer. So hold up anybody that tries to get you know, on your bad side or stop you with your progress. It's not going to happen, but it might be tiring and it might be stressful, but stick with it and stay strong within your power in moving forward. Okay. Now what you're attracting back again to the patience and to the full here, attracting the new beginning, attracting the new beginning and really being able to see, it's like, see your baby bloom, see your project bloom, uh, what you're creating, what you're starting bloom. So this has all been in the works, but this is something that you have been attracting. It's something that is happening. Even if it's slow, slow work, steady progress, it's going to happen because you've taken that leap and you're doing it. Okay. No matter how little the steps, no matter how big the steps. Okay. Now what you need to know. Taurus, I feel like this is a time where with this page of cups here, you're really tapping into the things that matter most to you in your heart, the things that make you really happy to express yourself with whatever this is, whatever you're trying to create. But there's also a lot of um, a lot of conflict around you. Okay. There could be issues or drama with friends, with family, people, just anyone around you here. So I think what you need to know is it's important to not get caught up in all that conflict and drama. Let it go. Let it be for the people who are all about it and who are having it. Let them gossip about what they want to gossip about. But what's important here is that you stay focused on your creative expression. Okay. Expressing yourself and staying in an energy that's positive and loving, uh, to where you can express yourself in a safe place because drama creates more drama. Conflict creates more drama. And who wants to deal with that? You know, I don't. <laughs> so, you know, it's all about letting go drama and letting go conflict, especially when it's not yours. Stay focused on your creative projects. Stay focused on things that make you feel good and positive energy and moving forward. Now, your outcome here with the Empress and the Queen of Swords. Be really direct and honest about what you're wanting to do. A lot of you might be getting into something where you have to speak. So some of you might be getting into or starting something where you're going to have to speak a lot, but it's going to help people. It's going to, uh, it's going to make people feel like they're supported. Okay. I don't know what work this is, but it might be something to where it's, it's really positive, but you're giving this kind of support. It's that kind of exchange. You know what I'm saying? It's like that motivational type support that people might need to hear or people might need to receive, but it's also, I see you really speaking your truth speaking your truth and being clear, being direct. And again, focusing on that abundance and that growth. So yeah, a lot of you are definitely creating something. Start of something new here. And it is going to be really fruitful and successful. You guys have the King of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. This is all about getting all your ducks in a row. This is all about being a, having a smart business mind, making sure things are as they need to be because it, there is going to be reward. But this is also, again, the, the energy of being kind and considerate and giving to others. So I feel like whatever it is that you are going to do or create or start 
here, Taurus, it's really going to help people. I think it's going to be really helpful and really supportive, very positive here. So stay focused, stay determined. Don't get caught up in conflict. Don't get caught up in, you know, who said what and who's doing this. Because <laughs> that can be a distraction. Stay focused on expressing yourself. And that Empress energy, that growth and that abundance, it will happen. You will see it. You will achieve it. And I'm seeing here that it's going to be a really positive thing for other people as well. Okay, so Taurus, let's get a monology card for you. For Taurus. What's the message for Taurus? Message for Taurus. Okay, Taurus, you have cool your emotions. So this is a time for you to stay really balanced within yourself. Again, not letting any arguments, chaos, chaos <laughs> conflict, anyone trying to come at you and get you going, upset you. All right, no, be that Debbie Downer, none of that. Turn the cheek, walk away, run away, whatever it is you want to do, but don't let them, don't let that energy you know, connect with you, stay focused on you, cool your emotions, keep your cool, stay calm, stay focused, express, grow, create. That's what you have here. Your power. Don't let anyone knock you off of your throne and what you're trying to do. Okay. Whether it's for you, whether it's for you and others, keep it cool, cool your emotions. But there's a lot of beautiful energy here. So yeah, I like it. I like it, Taurus. That's your reading, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe. All right, hit that like. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.